7 in the morning. It's 7 in the morning. Should I clean my room before or after I go out? Probably I should before, and I'm trying to drive to this one trail so I can walk. So just to make sure that I get everything that I want to do done, I'm going to clean the room after, okay? Even though it's looking mighty. Eesh, eesh. Yeah, well, I'm going to eat first. It's probably just a shaker. Right I made a breakfast in the last video, bro. I don't... Hey, I don't need to prove anything to y'all, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead, make breakfast, get dressed, and then head out to go to the trail that I wanna go to because that's like the main thing I wanna do today, to be honest. Then after that, we still have a lot of cool stuff planned, so. Okay. Uh, oh, boogeyman. figure out when sunset is so I can make sure that I leave at a decent time. Sunset is at 6.46 and it's 4.44 right now. I have time to clean my room somewhat. Okay, so I just got done vacuuming and everything. Uh, the room is looking good. These are actually some of the gifts that I got yesterday and today. So I'm gonna open those later, like when I get back. But yep, the room is clean. Took the time to do it. So I'm just gonna wear the beaters because I'm going on like a little trail. It's not a trail, it's a paved path. But um, I'm gonna still just wear these because they're comfortable and I don't know what I'm gonna end up doing, so. So before I can actually start going to the trail or whatever, I gotta get gas because I didn't do it before. Bro. My birthday was yesterday, for those of you that don't know. It was on October 8th. I got back super late. I got back at like 4. I was playing 2K, actually, until like 4 in the morning with my older brother. We were doing that, and I didn't end up putting gas back in the car. A lot of you guys have been asking me to do more Drive With Me content, but I don't really have anything to, one, talk about, or two, anywhere really significant to go. But I just got to stop looking into it too much because if you guys ask for something then i'ma just do it and not try to do like a bunch of extra stuff with it because if that's what you want to see then i might as well do that hopefully this gas station isn't packed when i first like started pumping gas i would pump the gas with my car on which i didn't really know was dangerous and that it could like explode or something so i just was doing that for a little bit but hopefully no one steals my camera that would suck the tank is almost filled up just from 20 bucks that's why you get honda civic that's why honda civic is top one car clears everything i don't like leaning this far back when i'm driving my sister does it but I don't really fuck with it. I like being upright in control. Okay, bro, whenever you turn out of my neighborhood, it looks so bad. You know that one picture where it's just a bunch of gas stations and shit? That's exactly what it looks like once you turn out of my neighborhood. It's crazy. But damn, it's hot in here, bro. It felt really good yesterday. It was like it was like 50s and 40s yesterday, so it felt really good. But that's not consistent every day yet. I haven't went on the highway in forever because I don't really have any reason to be going there. So I haven't went on there in a minute. I actually didn't bring any food because I forgot to. I meant to bring some though. My birthday was really, really fun though. We didn't do anything that crazy. We just had family over. We all went to my grandparents' house um, and just chilled, played games and ate food. But that's all I really wanted to do because I don't really feel like doing a bunch of extra stuff for my birthday because birthdays really don't even matter. It was super fun. We played uh, Smash Ultimate and 2K. Oh yeah, also we had a projector and a screen. So we tried to play the game outside which would be pretty cool but it just didn't 
doesn't really look as good as a TV. I really want to travel by train again because traveling by train was super fun. I went to DC for the concert and I went by train. It was so fun. This is why I don't like doing anything on the weekends because everyone else is out here. And really, only what I have to do matters. So I don't know why they're even here. It's really all just clear out. Let me go where I gotta go and call it a day. You know what I really need to get? I need to get a SPF. I need to get like a sunscreen for my face because I don't have one at all. And really, you're supposed to apply it like every two hours that you're in the, or every two hours throughout the day. That's what I've heard. Yeah, this is actually my first time going on this trail myself. I've been there two times. And normally I'll just walk and sit for a minute, which I think I'm gonna do this time too. I want to be able to get the sunset on camera. But I don't know like where, what direction the sun sets actually. I may or may not, but hopefully I'll get something. The great thing about taking exits is immediately the crowd thins out. Like no one is behind me. Everyone is on that main thing, highway, whatever. It emptied out so much as a car passes right by me. The leaves are changing colors. They're not like orange or red or anything, but they're definitely starting to change. It's not just straight green anymore. Most likely what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna listen to music the whole time I walk. I did bring a book, but I don't feel like, I probably won't read this. I had a couple Junji Ito mangas on my Amazon list because that's where they were getting the gifts from. Hopefully someone got me at least one of those. Damn, that's a big house. I have all the windows up for like wind and shit. Uh, so hopefully it's not as hot out of the car as it is in here because it's kind of steamy. Is this the turn in to it is kind of like hidden so hopefully oh there it is there it is there it is so last time i was here it was like a nice walking stick i left it here right is this it i think this is it damn I left that there months ago Let's look at the elite parking job though boom boom nice unfortunately i can already tell that it's not one of those days where i barely get hungry because i'm already like kind of hungry and i ate like maybe an hour ago i want to get a move on because the place where i normally like to sit and just chill is like a 40 minute walk down the trail so i want to get there before sunset i should have brought a hoodie i didn't bring a hoodie so it's probably gonna get cold actually looks so good i don't remember it looking this nice i took pictures at multiple different places but i only really remember a couple but this looks really good bro i can see you see the orange sun peeking at the top of those trees bro that means the sun is starting to set and i'm not anywhere close to where i want to be yet but it's whatever we're chilling She looks good. She looks really good. I'm not exactly at the point where I wanted to be, like the one that I had planned out to sit and watch it, but it's whatever. This still looks great. Looks really good. Oh my god, it's a cat. Oh, it was in that bush. Look, dude, that's just a super tiny cat. Yeah, it got pretty cold, but it's not like, you can still see it's light outside for sure. But I didn't feel like going the whole way, but I still got some really good shots, so. I don't really think I have anything to talk about on the way back, so I'm not gonna film it. But when we get back, I'm gonna show you guys some, like just some of the things that I got for my birthday. Not everything's came in yet, but I wanna show you what I have as of now, so. I'm out of the shower, I ate. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys, not all yet, but some of the gifts that I received for my birthday. Firstly, I got these, but I just got some uh, sweatpants right here. So I have two pairs of gray ones and one pair of black ones. The black ones are very, very like 
poofy, and they have a cuff at the bottom. And I don't like the ones with cuffs at the bottom or the tapered ones. I more so like the straight ones. This is what they look like. They look almost like pants. Damn, they're comfortable because they don't have a cuff at the bottom. So from far away, they just look like pants or something. But you know, these are for... Why do I really have to explain what the purpose of wearing sweatpants is? But it's when I want to prioritize comfort, but it's also getting a bit cooler. The ones with the cuffs at the bottom, they limit you so much in what you can actually wear because they look so weird in my opinion. So I got the straight cut ones, no cuff, anything. And they fit perfectly right out the box, like right off the bat. Also, my dad gave me these Air Maxes like a week or two ago because uh, he just didn't wear them. So he gave them to me. Sweatpants are super comfortable. I can fit my phone in here. That's about it, though. I don't like putting things in my pockets anyway. So that doesn't really matter. I think you can see everything from here. I think so. But yeah, that's what it looks like, bro. Literally exactly what I was looking for. These are workout shirts right here. This is what it looks like. As you can see, it's like a raglan style, which is cool. It's like the one that I have in there, but just an active wear version. So I'm gonna try it on and hopefully it looks good, but we'll see. So this is what the shirt looks like. It actually doesn't, it actually fits pretty good. It goes a bit long, to be honest. I think it would look better if it went like that. I think that would look better. Overall, I think they're worth keeping because I don't want them to be any shorter in the sleeve or any tighter, definitely. I don't want them to be any tighter than this. I think this is fine. Well, there's this one and then there's this color and this color right here. So the third thing that I want to show you guys is this. Uh, you might recognize what this is. This is a sunset lamp. I've been talking about this for literally so long and I just haven't got around to getting one. This right here, you just plug it in, turn it on. And then it starts flashing and changing different colors. So you gotta get the remote right here. I hate how small this shirt is. This is a medium. This is why I don't get medium tops anymore, bro. Anyway, and you can just change the color like that. And right now you can kind of see what it looks like, but if we turn, damn, that's bright. See, now it's behind me and stuff. That's what it looks like. I think that's a better display of what it looks like than just my face. Okay, so I haven't even went through all the colors yet. So there's, that's red, orange, yellow-ish. That might be my favorite. There's just different shades of red, pretty much. That's another yellow, green. Blue. Oh, that one's cool. That one's really nice. Right there. That one's really nice. And right there. White. It's like a greenish orange thing, but that's supposedly the white color. This is what came with it. It came with one of these little LED light remotes, but it is very unresponsive. Move it further back and that will cover more space, kind of like a projector. Also, the next thing that I got is another lamp, similar to the one that I have right here. I normally keep it right there, but I was streaming, so I wanted a lamp for my desk, but I got another one now, so I don't have to share that one lamp that I had, or that I have. This is the base right here. It has two USB outlets for charging. This on right here also it comes with a bowl oh why does this move around so much i think i gotta screw this on there's instructions right yeah i threw those away that's bright wait that oh wow oh wow. okay i was wondering how it worked also i can't really get this oh my. first off i couldn't get this to fit I didn't attempt it like that. I couldn't get it to stay still because it would just wobble around a bunch. I don't know what to do about that. Yeah, okay, so this part down, if I touch any part of it, right? Okay, that's setting one, that's setting two, and that's the brightest setting, and then it just turns off. And also the same with this area right here. This lamp right here is single-handedly illuminating the whole room, but let me turn that off real quick. So if I turn that off real quick and I tap the base of it, dang, wow, that looks really good. Oh, that, that looked cool. Yeah, the last thing that I have so far is this. It's the sander for you know, the furniture and stuff like that. Since it was my birthday and that interest happened to pop up very, very recently. It's nice that I was able to get this. This is actually Velcro right here. These are the instructions. I probably won't need these at all, to be honest. There's this little finger attachment that goes on. I don't know where. Yeah, I don't know how that works. Maybe I will need to read the instructions real quick. It goes on like the end and then you can go like into really detailed crevices and sand there. It also comes with two sanding pads or whatever. I don't even know what they're called. There's 120 grit and uh, 240 grit. Those are the ones that it comes with. I'm really glad I got this so now I can finally exfoliate my face. I wanna try it. Oh my god, that's loud. I've actually never heard what this sounds like before, so that was really loud. Very glad I finally got this because this is like the basis, right? Of restoration. Yeah. This is pretty much like the main tool you need, I think. So I'm glad I got that. That's everything that came in the box, and that's everything that I got for my birthday so far.
just gonna play 2K real quick. It is 2K17. I don't play games for real. The only games I play are like GTA Online, sometimes 2K, and Smash Ultimate. Besides that, I don't play any games. Really, all I do on here is blacktop against the computer. I could literally do that for hours, just listen to music or whatever. That's what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna start winding down for the day. Okay, so I'm tired of playing the game. That shit got boring pretty fast, but I think that's gonna be it. But yeah, always appreciate you guys who make it to the end of the video for watching all the way. But with that being said, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.